Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Lady Survival here. It has been like a month since I've filmed and it feels so good to be back but kind of weird to be filming myself. Today I have a really exciting video. You guys, if you've been around for a while, you might remember a while back I unboxed a gothic beauty box from gothic beauty magazine and they sent me another one to unbox with you guys. So excited to dive in here. I have no idea what to expect at all and this one is going to be extra exciting because we're actually collabing myself and gothic beauty box and we're going to be giving you guys a free gothic beauty box. So basically the details on that is that you will have to go to the link that I put down below which is a link to download the digital copy of gothic beauty magazine and then you can use my code lady survival to get it for free. So totally for free you just have to go there download it use my code and then also you'll have to comment down below on my youtube video what your favorite item is from this box so of course keep on watching and then just leave a comment of what your favorite item is in here and make sure to also download the free magazine on their website as well with my code lady survival so i'll put all the details of how to do that in the description so you make sure you cover all of the steps there and i just want to say thank you so much to gothic beauty magazine for wanting to collab with me again and doing this fun giveaway. I appreciate it so much wanting to give stuff to my community. I love the Gothic Beauty Box. I've been using so much of the like makeup products that came in the last one so I'm excited to extend my collection. I'm even wearing the necklace that I got from the last one. This is like one of my favorite necklaces now so yeah. Anyways, let's get into unboxing this. Cutting into this box, I'm so excited, especially for the makeup goodies. I have been using that last palette so much. It was like the one with all the orange colors in it, which I don't really use the oranges that much. I mean, they're super fun, but the blacks and like just the dark shades in there are so good. I've already hit pan on the black one. We have just busted into this box. Oh my gosh. So exciting. Okay. So here is the makeup magazine. This is issue number 55. So the last one I did was 54 and I love the aesthetic of this one. It's very like winter queen kind of vibe. I'm just going to throw this up here for a second. Wow. So cool. Check it out. What do you guys think? I really just love that now I'm kind of like growing my collection and I can put this one with my other magazine. That's so cool. I really want to, oh my God, I wonder if I'm in here to be honest. I was just gonna say, I really, yeah, I am. Oh my God, that's so cool. I was like, how do you get in here? And guys, look, look at that. I'm in the magazine. It says from YouTube. Oh my gosh, and then I follow this girl. I like, I'm friends with her. I'm right beside Valentine's Corpse. That's so cool. So there's my YouTube thumbnail at Lady Survival Wow. I'm really, really happy with everything. I feel like I got a lot of stuff. So I would say it's definitely worth it. If you're into gothic alternative stuff, this would definitely be a fun little box to get. That's so cool. I made it in the magazine. I didn't even know that that was like a thing. Like I wasn't sure if they'd have to like contact you about that or what, but that is so exciting. I'm like checking now to see if there's anything else with me in it. Oh wow, look, I don't even know if this is from this one, but look at that pair of socks. If that's in here, I'm gonna be like freaking out. Look at how many cute little socks they have and stuff. I could probably keep you guys here all day just going through the magazine, so I'm just gonna get back to the unboxing and I'll have to look through this later, but this is so cool. I can't believe I made it in the magazine. Thank you so much, Gothic Beauty Magazine. That makes me feel so cool. Back to the box. The next thing is this little like list. It tells you everything that's in the box, but I'm not gonna look at it because I want it to all be a surprise. Oh, it's so exciting. It came with the same tissue paper and like the purple crinkle stuff again too. So I'm seeing a lot of stuff. The first thing that's really catching my eye is whatever this little gingerbread guy is. I'm guessing, yeah, a cookie mold. That is so cool. Um, let's start with the stickers because I feel like that's like a good obvious one to start with on the top. These are so cool. I love them. We have this coffin shaped one, a uh, lip service sticker. That's awesome. This has become like my little mirror of like cool stickers that I get from brands. Another lip service sticker. These are so awesome. Let's go in and check out this cookie mold a little bit more. This is so awesome. It has like the little skeleton bones. I don't know if it actually puts the bones into the cookie. Maybe you can do that somehow. But I want to actually check. 
Oh my god, okay, yeah, that's so cool. It says roll out cookie dough and then use like the actual mold to cut the cookie and then use the other side to imprint the skeleton texture mold thing on it. That is so cool. These are like huge cookies. Like, I mean, not really, but I never make really big cookies, so I'm really excited. But you can imprint that into the cookie. We have to do this as like a YouTube video. That sounds like so much fun. I love that. The next thing is a necklace, which I'm so happy about because I love jewelry. I feel like I don't have enough jewelry. I mean, I probably do, but I always just want more. And like I said, I've been wearing this necklace so much. So I am just so happy to have another one. And I really like this one, one, because it's black and it's a cross, but two, because it's so like long, you know, like this other one's a little shorter. I actually like specifically made it extra short today by like hooking it further into the chain, but this is really cool. We're gonna put this on, cause why not? Just have like three necklaces on, cause that's cool. I always get stuck in my hair. Boom, there we go. I know you guys can't really see it, but it's there and it's cool and I love it. I like to keep trying to show you guys the box so you can see where we're at. Looks like we have another sticker, um, Gothic Beauty sticker, very, very cool. Add that to our sticker collection down there. The next thing that's popping up to me is this thing. This is a pin, so cool. Collectible metal enamel pin. It's from Jasmine Beckett Griffith. That is so awesome. I love it. Oh wow, there's even, look at all of the other ones that you can get. I love that one. I know I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's got like purple wings. That's so cool. I think that this is awesome because the cross that she's holding, if it wants to like focus, it's kind of hard to see, but it's like the same style of cross that this one is. So that's like very suiting for it. That's super awesome. We definitely still have a lot of goodies left. We have uh, something here, another one here, here, and here. So there's still lots of like makeup goodies. And then whatever this is, I'm really curious. This seems to be kind of like the biggest thing that's in here. So what is this? We have like a spider web pattern on it, but I have no idea what it is. Oh, oh my God. Are these like arm things? Two of them popped out. So I wonder if that's what that is. Oh my God, these are so cool. Give to me, yeah, little arm things, right? I don't know if there's like a top or a bottom for this. Maybe that's the bottom. Yeah, this side's more stretchy. Let's try it that way. Dun, dun, dun. Little arm warmers. I don't know if there's a thumb hole. I don't think I see one, but there's like something kind of like in there. I don't know if that's supposed to be a thumb hole or if that's just like the stitching, but Hey, super, super cool. It's awesome because I have like this long like cardigan over thing that's like super long down to the ground and it's kind of a similar pattern to this, but sometimes I don't feel like wearing it because it's just so like long. I forget what like it's called, but this is cool because this is just like an easy thing to throw on and it gives like the effect of having like an awesome like outfit accessory thing on. I think I get it now. You know how I was like, there's like a thing it is a little thumb hole. It's an actual like thumb finger thing. Okay, let me try this again. I was like, I felt like there was something here, but this one was like inside out, so I couldn't really get in. There we go. That's so cool. I absolutely love that. This is probably my favorite thing so far because I wasn't expecting like clothing accessory type stuff. So that's awesome. But I guess that this is kind of similar to like the socks that we got last time, but this time it's arm warmers. So we have a couple of like makeup products in here. Let me just kind of pull them all to the top just to kind of show you guys like how many things truly come in this box. There's literally like five makeup type products in here and that's not including all the other stuff that we already got so that's really awesome this is hilarious i'm just looking and it looks like this is one of those eyeliner stamp things and it's a heart one and it's so funny because on valentine's day just the other day i put little hearts but i had to like hand draw them with my own eyeliner and it was so hard and i kept messing it up and i could have benefited from this so much so that's just really funny suited for valentine's day for sure this is awesome because i got one last time and it was like a spider web stamp so like a halloween themed kind of thing and now this one is a heart so i'm really excited i really want to put one on is this the right way i really hope so little heart oh it's so cute okay let me try again it's so hard to do this without a mirror and i probably didn't put them like level but hey 
it's cute and I love it and that's so perfect. I've always wanted a heart one and then of course the other side we have our little eyeliner. I'm not even going to put it on because I've already tested it. Actually I will. I will put it on. I tested it last time. It's the same brand as last time. But yeah, it's good. Standard black eyeliner, works really well, stays on really good. I love it. Next thing, soft black makeup blender. Ooh, beauty blender sponge. I needed to buy a replacement one because I've been using the same one for like two or three years. It's so cute. It even says Lashy Doodle. So it's from that brand that they always seem to work with. Seems to be like some little lint pieces on it, but that's okay because we're going to like wet it and stuff. But that's so cool. It's so aesthetic like it's so simple like the ones that I have are like I have like a teal one and a pink one which is cute but the aesthetic of like black it's like yeah just like the makeup things I love it what is this one Ooh, a liquid eyeliner so we get two eyeliners this time I'm assuming this is also lashy doodle I think that that's all of the makeup products from them but it's not actually labeled but I'm gonna assume that this is lashy doodle Ooh, interesting. Okay, so just kind of standard uh, liquid eyeliner. Let me try to demonstrate for you guys. Yeah, just kind of standard. Oop, kind of... I, I am very bad at applying it on my hand, and I'm tipping this sideways, but uh, you get the idea. It works really well. I'm a bad demonstrator, but I'll have to actually try that on my eyes to, to see how it feels applying it and everything, but I just, I suck at demonstrating on my hand. Uh, two more things left. Let's check this one out. It's another little um, roll-on thing. We got one last time and the last one was like autumn cloves or something like that, so very autumn scented. This one says Midnight Cherry Vanilla and that is just so cool. One, because it's red, so I'm getting like a vampire aesthetic. But two, that sounds like a scent that I really would super love and enjoy. Oh my god. It reminds me of like Coca-Cola. Like the vanilla Coke, I think, is what I'm getting. Cherry vanilla Coke. But more sweet than that. Oh my god, I wish I could roll it on my wrist, but I'm wearing uh, little gloves. So let's just put it on my finger. There we go. Oh my god, it smells so good. I absolutely love that. I love how pretty it is. Why is it so pretty? And then the last and final item, I have no idea what it is. It's kind of heavy though, so is this like, I don't know, like a perfume or like foundation are my guesses? Okay, what is this mystery item? Ooh, okay, Dark Asteroid Pretty Ghostly Foundation and Lightning Potion. Oh my gosh, is this a white foundation? because that is crazy. I have like nowhere to uh, <laughs> to put it because I put the gloves on. Hold on. I just want a tiny, tiny little pump. I don't want to use too much. Oh my god. I'm scared. Ooh. Oh my gosh. It's like kind of purple. I don't know. Maybe that's just my lighting because I have like purple lights on. Maybe it is just white. Oh my god. That is so cool. It is totally just white. I'm like getting a purple glow. So I was like, oh my god, it's purple. That is crazy. I don't have much room for blending and I think that too much came out but hey just saying that's like covering my my tattoos oh my god I've never had a white foundation before so that is so exciting I'm gonna go wash this off because I don't want to ruin the gloves and just too much came out on that first pump but I'm so excited I'm gonna have to do a makeup tutorial with that that is so awesome so that is everything that we got in the box let's do a little recap of everything that we got but i'm wearing the gloves and the necklace because i really don't want to take them off but other than those two we got a little pin and a skeleton gingerbread cookie mold in terms of makeup products we got a eyeliner with a heart stamp a liquid eyeliner and then a little roll-on wrist thing and then we also got a white foundation and a little beauty blender sponge i just realized those go so perfectly together. Great thinking. And finally, we also got our stickers. We got three of them all together. I love the aesthetic of all of these. And then we have our issue 55 magazine, which I have on display here. I still can't believe that I'm in there. I'll have to check it out more to see if there's anything else. That is all of the items. Let me know what you guys thought of this box and what your favorite item is. Remember, if you want to be entered into the giveaway, you will have to comment what your favorite item is from this box and then also go download the the issue 55 on their website using my code lady survival make sure that you use my code because that's how gothic beauty is going 
to track uh, who all entered the giveaway and then you also have to make sure to leave a comment on my video so do those two things check the description again for the clear guideline of how to do that I really hope that you guys enjoyed it my favorite item is definitely these hand gloves they're just so cool and I really really like the necklace as well I'll probably try to do a makeup tutorial testing out the white foundation because that is just so awesome and the eyeliners and all that good stuff stay tuned for that thank you guys for being patient with me and not uploading for like a month or so and thank you again gothic beauty magazine for collabing with me it's so much fun unboxing these it's totally just totally right up my alley that's all that i've got for you guys today i hope that you enjoyed and i'll see you next time bye